Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, I'm the Hesonite Angel. Uh, when last we left off in my sketchbook, it was this page. I only know because I've left it on this page since the week or two I last made it. This was when I first started watching Miraculous Ladybug. Uh, nobody's commented on anything, so I'm just going to, if I have something interesting to say about a sketch, explain that. Uh, this was my old concept. It was... Not an old con. It was my old online persona, Seer of Anime. I have no clue. A lot of these are just my concept of before anything about the Peacock Miraculous was revealed, my character which was just a self-insert. Uh, and the whole like backpack thing is I tended to carry a messenger bag that when I could I would keep snacks in. And I thought I would have been good friends with the Peacock Miraculous before Dosu was revealed. I still think we do. We would just be an emotional mess together. I should, uh, because I've been redoing old OCs, I should redo the self-insert. Before the Peacock's Miraculous was revealed, I thought the weapon was going to be a fan, where the individual feathers were throwing knives. As you can see, my anatomy was terrible. It's still bad, but not as bad. Uh, flower themed dresses, which is something I've still have been very into always. Uh, that was when Volpino was theorized about to be a good guy. This has aged poorly. <laughs> I had a thing for Lala back then. Then her character was revealed and I'm like, ooh, no, honey. Emotions. Gone. Just me working on flowers. More, I tell ya. I was trying to create characters for all 50 states. Oop. This is a old concept for... So I have this story I've been meaning to work on, and it's called The Spirit and the Sword, and it's basically a Legend of Zelda fan comic where Fee is reborn as well. And I make Fee this... really sassy toddler. Just a little kid that is. I've been playing with the idea of gear him being reborn as well because I think those two are cute together. But it as I start developing the story it focuses less on her romance as she goes, hey look more homestuck and more on the concept of having a found family. Me practicing Link. I have no idea. Color to tell you drawings. Flower concept. Mm. These were concepts for like making my own Greek gods. Uh, Dionysus and Persephone, I don't remember, but I believe she was the goddess of aquifers. So, Poseidon and Persephone was what she was. Kumatized peacock. I don't even know what I was going to make my hero name back then. Because now it would 100. Hey, look, Hinata. 100% be something like Phoenix or something. Because I think Phoenix makes a badass gender neutral name. More old concepts. An old Italia character concept. I 
had friends who would go through them and then they liked the uh, dynamic between. Her original name was going to be Mod Fee. But now it's just going to be Fee because Link and Zelda's names rarely change. Kind of because I start teenager concepts. There's a point where I got back into Conan his next store for a while. Through years of friendship, that was more of a reference of Zelda was celebrating its 30th anniversary, I think, and it's always been, because I'm not 30, I'm only 23 at the making of this video, so I couldn't have been 30 in that, but it was how me and my dad bonded, and still do bond. I was in a real angsty mood. Alright. That's it for this sketchbook. Um, next time I will have a different sketchbook. Let me just open this while I... to something I'm proud of from the sketchbook while I talk. Let's go with this mod feed design. Uh, next time I do a sketchbook tour, it will be of a different one, obviously, and hopefully I've written dates on that. I probably won't do any of the loose stuff till I finish the sketchbooks, which are on top of my tote thing, but uh, thank y'all for watching. Talk to you later. Bye.